Okay, so friggin' uh, just on our way to in once again, right, buddy? One one pug one. One pug one. One pug one. One one pug one. Yeah, so friggin' uh, we're addicted to smelt now, right, buddy? Yeah, bud. Yeah, so we, I stayed up late last night and made some new smelt pots. And uh, maybe we're gonna try copper or something. We gotta get all them coals and different things out of that friggin' smelting container because. Well, she's fouled up, eh? and you can't get her sunk down deep enough into the coals for the chooch. But, uh, anyways, freaking, I'll show you my new smelting apparatus. Uh, it'll be more awesome. Well, I got the smelting bug, boys. Frig's sake. So, I made these last night instead of like putting some stuff away and situating my zone and doing stuff. I just like made these smelting containers, and I got some things right there. So, this little antler here is for grabbing that hole in the bottom. And then this little ant really here, you just give her the old pinch, stick her in the holes there, and then you can like lift your program up and you know, you grab the, the hole in the bottom there and you grab it with the other stick there and, and there you go. And then you can pour your smelt, right? So I made two, one's for copper and one's for the aluminums, but uh, after researching on the interwebs, I'm probably not going to be able to get the uh, heat I need to uh, melt the copper, but we're going to try anyway, frig it, right? But uh, yeah, off to smelt and we go. Well, we got her up and running, boys. Check this out. Holy shit. Can't hold her close too long, boys. You can hear my camera melting. But, uh, yeah, I got all these pop cans from the neighbor. The guy across the road over here. You can see him staggering back over there to grab some more. Yeah, gave me all these pop cans. There's only one thing, though. These ones here are just soaked in dog piss. Oh my goodness, look at there's like a big hair clump and stuff there. The dog used the one bag of cans as a toilet, so these ones reek, so they're the first ones we're smelting. But uh, I don't know how many I got in there, seven, eight hundred probably. But uh, I'm gonna, once it gets up to the top closer, I'm gonna sl pull the slag out of her there and uh, keep feeding her in until uh, we can, you know, do a great big pour. I want to pour that. I, I fixed it a little bit, so it'll be more better. Up a glyph thing, and then we'll pour the rest in there. It'll be more awesome. But we're gonna uh, we're gonna try to smelt some copper, boys. Look at it. Holy shit, that's hot. But uh, I don't know. But we're gonna try. If you look way over there, you'll see uh, buddy smelting operation got out of hand. Frig's sake, got the fire dicks out. Friggin' uh, gonna come to the rescue, buddy smelting operations. But ours is still up and running. We're smelting big times. They're not pro, bud. Oh, I put it out. Oh, no, it's still good. Look at that for frig's sake. Copper takes a long time to melt, boys. Son of a bitch. Got some uh, intake holes this time, though, so that's good. Bad, not too bad. A little bit, yeah. Cut it down and put some screws on the back. Yeah. One bug like that cam. Well, copper don't melt, boys. Simple as that. Look, you can tell. She ain't gonna get much redder, I don't figure, and uh, she's still totally wire in there. Although aluminum's does melt. Beg my bard. Well, it was a late night last night, but uh, her smelting operation went to shit, boys. We only got two good smelts out of her. That one's the best one so far. Of all of them, that was the, the first smelt, and the second smelt, and then the third smelt, and then that was the last smelt. And that one's pretty awesome, but uh, I'm gonna add this guy to the uh, smelting process and uh, hope to get a hotter fire. Check this shit out. So that's what we're after there. We got the, uh, the old rusty pipe there uh, attached onto the son of a bitch. I, uh, I was gonna. Uh, Modify the hole a little better, but uh, I jammed her in there and I 
it seems to uh, be stuck in there good, but I don't know, probably be better if that was laying on the ground. So you kind of, in accordance with the arc of the pipe, if it's laying on the ground, it'll be like nice, you know, and it'll shoot the fire up the side of the chooch there, but uh, we lost a couple smelts. The fire cooled down and then, uh, well, what happened was we started loading pop cans in there. And there was so much dog piss in them. Where is it? All these ones here, there was so much dog piss in them that uh, they frigged over the smelt and then uh, the old smelting pot friggin' cracked open. Look at that, all that. Aluminums, all that over there. More aluminums. So we gotta pick as much of the crap out as possible and then we'll bust those up and re-smeltulate them. But the whole bottom of the of the old tank there should give out, boys. We had her we had her too nuclear, but see it cooled down and I was scooping the top and a lot of that's friggin' aluminums on there. I'm gonna have to get like a 75 extension cords too, for frig's sake, so I think I might uh, bury some conduit to get some hydro out here for such an occasion, eh bud? Yeah. Oh, are you smoking cigarettes? Oh, well, it looks like a good cigarette, bud. Yeah. Is it premium? Viceroy premium. Oh, Viceroy premium, boys. Friggin' rates, but uh, yeah, so that's, uh, that's gonna be the, the third try. We'll see if we can heat these cocksuckers up. Friggin' glowing orange purple and stuff, beg my pardon. I was gonna take uh, a load of scraps in today, but uh, the friggin' door on the trailer is friggin' deck day. Eh? This one right here, it's just like, it's all one piece now. There's no pipe inside or nothing, so I tried heating her, heating her, heating her. I got the one on the other side freed up, but that one's cocked, I might need to cut it right off and make new, but I uh, hope not. I'm gonna try putting the the heat to her big time later on but got to be careful too because of the light situation right so freak's sake but uh oh crap it's a dodge boys I'm scared her's for a good thing i'm behind big dumpy holy hey careful careful there's a dodge bud uh oh but yeah so we cleared a bunch of her out getting there getting there I'm gonna probably melt down all them chairs and stuff and different things I'm gonna build a big lean-to on the back i gotta still talk to the city about that so or the township anyway See what they have to say and stuff, but but anyways, I got things and I gotta go. So when I get back, we'll uh, see about smelting some more if it's not raining for frig's sake. What's happening with your cigarettes, bud? Look at this shit. Like you gotta pretty much break the pack to open them, and you can't do this because it'll just rip the pack. Awesome. Look not only that, on we too. have a you know buddy that. Was licking too much groove or something. That's dicked, bud. You should smoke another cigarette. Mmm. Nice. Oh. oh, you did it, bud. You did it. Woo. Oh, time for a cigarette. Anyways, check that out, boys. You know what that is? That's my package from Starpus. Are you smoking cigarettes, bud? Yeah, buddy. Already? <laughs> <I'm> already. <laughs> I smoke when I sleep. Oh, apologize. Beg my part. But uh, anyways, we got things. Got to go back to Inwood and smelt. But it's looking like it's going to rain for freak's sake. So, look at Dicker. Holy crap, boys, check this out. Tearing down this old church in St. Thomas, for frig's sake. Look at the structure. That's friggin' awesome. I need some of that. Like that big wood right there and stuff. And holy crap. Why would they do that? Frig's sake, think of all the stuff to smelt in there. Right, bud? Mm. Yeah. I don't know why they're ripping it down. I don't know. Seems a little ridiculous salvage a lot of that. Look at that big beam he's just wrecking. Look at that. Wrecking it. Unbelievable. Wow. Look at it. Just cocked over perfectly good ceiling fan for frig sakes. I could have used that. There's still a good one back there though. Frig sake. Build materials boys. I need that kind. Well we got the smelting rig fired up now boys. Found this old hair dryer in the garbage, tore the end out of it because it was all plugged up with kite big time. And uh, yeah, I'll show you so that you, you, you believe me. Yeah, we're small now, boys. So we made a little for frig sake, sir. A piece of wood to try to friggin' block in the chooch. 
So I'm going to fill the inside there with little wood bits. Just give me a sec. Well, we got it quite a bit hotter than before. I old lady found an old cast iron frying pan. So we used that, but it still bubbled. Look at this. Oh my goodness, we made a mess, boys. Used an old aluminum pan and she melted right through. Well, she's a lot hotter than yesterday. This is a uh, redneck blast furnace right here, boys. That's what we got going here, bud. Got the logs in the zone to keep the fire where we want it and stuff. That's awesome. I don't know how good you can see it, but that uh, aluminum's is cherry friggin' hot. And it was so hot that even though I preheated my friggin' uh, frying pan there, it cracked it. See? Frick's sake. I wanted to make a bunch of those, but I only ended up being able to make one. Son of a bitch. And there's this one here. It got all frigged over, but still cool. Still cool. But, uh, yeah, it got through the piss cans. It got through all the piss cans, so I got uh, one garbage bag there and just the rest of that one to smelt down, and then we can do ease troughs and different things, those lengths of stuff, and another one there and stuff, and pieces of friggin' uh, hinge, even the pins aluminum in that. So, friggin' rights, boys. Smelting operations is up and running big times now, yeah. Look at that, boys. That's a good smelting part right there. That's a good smelt part right there, bud. Yeah. Just melting down some of the uh, runoff from the other friggin' situation we had, but poured another uh, pug one ingot. Yeah. Get you some at pugwing.com, hey? No, just kidding, for freak's sake. Got scrap my scrap metals, I need to sell that, but uh, yeah, this one's pretty much pooch, so I'll probably cut that up or squish it down and melt this whole friggin' spiel. More ingots and stuff, more ingots. Yeah, love that kind. Holy shit, that's red, boys. That's, uh, that's a good fire right there, Fry. That's a good fire right there, Fry. Well, that's a good ingot right there. Look at that. Friggin' buttered her right out until she's ready even. Yeah. Friggin' right, so that's a good little friggin' ingot maker right there, bud. That's cool. Yeah. Frig, yeah, that's friggin' hot. Got her shut down for a minute. Holy, I need to friggin' uh, cool my jets here, probably, because my jets are warm. Different things, so, frig's sake. That's pretty friggin' cool, boys. That's a pretty clean, uh, clean looking ingot there, boys. If I must, if I, if I can do say so myself. She's pretty friggin' warm though still, so I'll just leave her alone. Oh, we, we got a new pipe feeder. Jefferson friggin' uh, invented it. Works good. Except for we got a plug, right, buddy? Yeah. It's yeah. Hot. Yeah, and it's, it's really hot, so. Oh crap! Careful, it don't tip over in there. Shouldn't. But... Okay, let me in there to straighten that out a little bit. Got the smelter up and running. Got some greasy egg salad sandies. Smell like shit. Look at the friggin' smelt, boys. Well, that's a smelt. Yeah. Look at the fire chooching down in the stove pipe there. The old can feeding apparatus. Yeah. So, anyways, uh, I forgot to show you the uh, package I got from Starpus there. I got uh, four of these cameras here. They're more awesome. They got uh, zoom and focus on the back there. Get the rustler out of here. Built-in friggin' antler, different things, stuff like that. And he sent me a bunch of antlers. I don't know if you can see them very good. The light's not uh, the greatest in here. But uh, just different ends and stuff. And uh, and then this thing. It looks like it's a secret microphone antler. So that's more awesome. -er. So anyways, friggin' rights. Uh, Star Plus, ladies and gentlemen. Big, big fan. Go check out his videos. It rebuilds different things, quads, motorbikes, uh, different things. So if you check that out, uh, Star Plus, I'll put the link. But uh, anyways, uh, I'm going to go out and do the rest of the smelting for tonight. And I'll show you all the ingots we got. Oh crap, the redneck uh, friggin' blast furnace friggin' worked too good. Look at the size of the hole we burnt in the uh, side of the steel there. So if we're melting steel, we'll definitely be able to melt copper, right buddy? Yeah, man, definitely. Oh, big time, big time. So. We blew, we had a blowout. I was preheating the, uh, the cigarettes right there. But you can see we got some aluminums all over the place, so. Freak sakes, we lost another smelt, boys. It's a good thing, though. Now we know we can melt copper for sure. Oh yeah, for sure. We'll get, uh, 
we'll get the other one out maybe we'll just have to keep an eye on the temperature i got like an electronic type digital laser pointing type gizmo but i can't find it right now so you know we'll kind of try to regulate the temperature but uh yeah that's hot over there bud that's awesome that's pretty hot so trial and error trial yeah and error. trial and error Trial and error, but uh, the redneck blast furnace, everything I got here, dryer I found in the garbage, piece of pipe I found in the garbage, freaking thing was already here, the big stove, uh, fire pit thing, everything, free, wood was all free, cans were all free, awesome. freaking right spot, free smelting, gotta love it. Oh crap, freak six, so we got that big long one, four of them guys, one little crazy clamshell looking thing, I thought that was neat. And then this is tonight's smelt. We got that, pretty heavy. Not too bad, not too bad. Got that guy, yeah. And then two of these thicker ones. I made some dirty thick ones. This one frigged up big time, but still cool. And then uh, that, I tried to fill this up, but we didn't have uh, enough juice. But uh, look, what did. look what it did to the bottom. Freaking melted a hole right into it. Turned it into Swiss math, but like instantly. Yeah, it wasn't friggin' around, that's for sure. So, so we'll have to chisel that out, we'll have to dig all that crap out of the campfire. We'll do like a dirty smelt. Do like a dirty smelt, it'll be more awesomer. That's pretty awesome, eh, bud? Are yeah. you smoking dirty cigarette butt? Yeah, it's cigarette butt actually. Frig sakes. Cigarette butt cool. mining. But yeah. Got some friggin' aluminum pie. For a friggin' campfire, eh? We sure smelted the shit out of stuff, eh? Melting steel. Yeah, so we're gonna try copper with the with the new and improved uh, redneck friggin' smelting friggin' apparatus. But uh, friggin' rights, boys. So there it is, all uh, all together there. This is a friggin' heavy piece right there. Probably friggin' close to three feet long and four or five inches wide and inch and a half thick at this end and probably three quarters or seven eighths that end. But uh, Friggin' right, so that's got to be 50 pounds anyways, 50 pounds of smelt, plus we lost a bunch, right? You know, probably lost 20 pounds anyway, if not more. That garbage bag was pretty friggin' heavy, and all the cans, but like a handful of them were in there, so. I'm going to guesstimate 55.5. A few folks can come closest to the number or they'll win a prize. What do you think the prize will be, bud? Maybe some cigarette butts? Maybe fucking unload one. Oh my goodness, them. you need to sell down, bud. I'll unload one for free. Oh, that's crazy. Guesstimate. Okay. Yeah, how about that guesstimate? See what... Uh, I'm saying 55.5. I say 51.3. Uh, 51.3? Yeah. Okay, you can get a free unloading. Yeah, free. <laughs> you get your clock friggin' ticket punched in by friggin' that Sylvester over here, eh? <laughs> Sylvester Stallone, for frig's sake. Beg my part. But anyways, boys. Who knows, maybe uh, tomorrow we'll be able to smelt some copper, but I gotta do some uh, some stuff in here a little bit, maybe just a little bit though, and then we'll go smelt. But uh, anyways, check out uh, Starpus on the YouTube TVs, and then we cheat, of course. So uh, friggin' right. Oh, Aluminum XOPs has a, maybe a hookup for some smelting sand. So friggin' right. Oh, I think I singed. I smelt some burning hair, got close to the fire. Didn't know where it was coming from, but uh, anyways, freaking, uh, there you go, another Dickard Pug One production. So until tomorrow. Don't let the watchers get you.